HIL India Limited is a CPSC under the administrative control of Department of Chemicals and Petrochemicals, Ministry of Chemicals and Fertilizers. Formerly known as Hindustan Insecticides Limited, the company was incorporated in the year 1954 to manufacture and supply DDT to Ministry of Health's National Malaria Control Program. In early 80s, the company diversified into agrochemicals to meet the requirements of agriculture sector, which is the primary source of livelihood for about 60% of India's population. Today, the company stands tall as the only CPSC manufacturing and supplying plant protection chemicals with the objective of fulfilling the Government of India's aim of doubling the farmer's income by 2022. In 2011, the company entered into seed segment with the production of seed varieties of different crops and supplying under seed mini kits under various schemes of Ministry of Agriculture and Farmers' Welfare. Further filling its product basket in 2015, HIL India Limited made its foray in fertilizer segment and tied up with fellow PSUs like NFL and RCF and organizations like IFCO and SSP manufacturers for the trading of fertilizers through company's own dealer network. Mosquito-borne diseases, namely malaria, dengue, chikungunya, Zika, Japanese encephalitis and filaria continue to be major killer diseases. As per the WHO World Malaria Report, half of the world's population lives in malaria transmission areas and developing nations, mainly in Africa and Southeast Asia region, are most vulnerable. WHO has recommended two primary vector control interventions, namely indoor residual spraying, that is spraying the human habitat with insecticides and use of long-lasting insecticidal nets, LLIN. Supporting Government of India's goal to eliminate malaria by 2030, HIL India Limited is setting up manufacturing of LLINs with the co-funding of United Nations Industrial Development Organization, UNIDO, under their project, Development and Promotion of Non-POP Alternatives to DDT. LLINs are mosquito nets impregnated with insecticide, which were introduced in the country in the year 2009. They provide two levels of protection. First, as a mechanical barrier against the bites of malaria-carrying mosquitoes, and second, as a means of killing mosquitoes on contact with the insecticide. With the current demand of 60 million nets per annum, the supply in the country is mainly import-dependent, and still there exists a huge gap between demand and supply of LLIN in the country. To reduce this import dependency, HIL India is setting up LLIN manufacturing unit at its Rasayani unit in Maharashtra. The manufacturing starts with compounding of pesticide, pigment and LDPE to produce master batch using twin screw extruder which is used to mix fillers and additives with the polymer in a continuous manner, blending different polymers and compounding particulates into plastics. Warping process converts the yarn packages into a warper's beam having desired width and containing requisite number of ends. The yarn is then knitted by joining consecutive row of loops using different types of knitting machines and then pass through the stenter machine to bring the length and width to predetermined dimensions and for heat setting. The fabric is then sewed and finally the baling press compresses materials into a larger bale which is convenient for transport or storage. The fabric is stitched as per net dimension and packed as per specifications. With this LLIN plant, the company will become the first CPSC to manufacture this product indigenously under the Government of India's flagship program, Make in India. HIL's vision is to provide quality products through clean and safe technology for enhancing agricultural productivity and promoting public health. 
thereby contributing to improved economy and healthy nation. As the famous saying goes, a healthy nation is a wealthy nation.